pilgrims and visitors. In St. Peter's Square, the sun was shining and the atmosphere was lively. The interaction between Pope Francis and the pilgrims is inspiring and has not dwindled over time. However, the issue the Pope addressed today in his catechesis is a demanding one. He asked for involvement to finally end hunger. La povertà in astrato non ci interpella, ma ci fa pensare, ci fa lamentare. Ma quando tu vedi la povertà nella carne di un uomo, di una donna, di un bambino, ah, questo sì interpella. E per questo quell'abitudine che noi abbiamo di fuggire, l'abitudine di fuggire dei bisognosi, di non avvicinarci, o truccare un po' la realtà dei bisognosi. The Pope began his new cycle of catechesis on the corporal works of mercy, talking about the first one to feed the hungry. Hay situaciones de necesidad entre nosotros que requieren una respuesta inmediata y urgente. Por ejemplo, dar de comer al hambriento, dar de beber al sediento, ambas son obras de misericordia corporales. Es muy dura la experiencia del hambre y la sed, y desgraciadamente es una realidad actual y cercana a nosotros. The Pope recalled that the faith of a Christian depends on how he treats the needy, because God is in each one of them. In that sense, he warned against a welfare culture because it forces people to look away from the needs of others. Una delle conseguenze del cosiddetto benessere è quella di condurre le persone a chiudersi in se stesse, rendendole insensibili alle esigenze degli altri. The Pope concluded his catechesis recalling fragments of Benedict XVI's encyclical, Caritas in Veritate. In it, his predecessor stressed that feeding the hungry is an ethical imperative for the Universal Church.